In today's day and age, drones really are everywhere. And be it in a covert military operation or in the skies over your local park, drones have seen a lot of use in both the professional and entertainment sectors. However, there are some drones that are so tiny that they could easily fly right by you without you even noticing them. So today we're going to be giving you the inside scoop on some of the tiniest of the bunch by counting down the top 10 smallest drones in the world on this episode of Super Freaky Science. But before we do, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification button so that you never miss out on our latest content. While most of the choppers in the US arsenal are massive military machines, this pint-sized edition of Norwegian manufacturer Fleur may just be as impressive. Measuring in at just 10 by 2.5 centimeters and weighing just 16 grams, their claim to fame is their high-tech camera, which gives the operator full motion video and still images. These drones can fly for about 20 minutes before needing to be recharged, and they're typically used by soldiers to scout out an enemy area or to fly around walls in order to detect dangers that are ahead. However, although their effectiveness has caused major military powers such as France, the United Kingdom, Germany, Australia, Norway, the Netherlands, and India to also purchase them due to their high cost of about $190,000 per unit, many experts predict that they are too expensive for large-scale deployment. Typically speaking, the words drone and affordable are rarely spoken in the same sentence. However, the Sky Nano 2 drone turns this assumption on its head due to it only costing about $19 a pop. Primarily made as a toy, the sky is insanely tiny as it comes in at just 4x4x2.2 four by four by centimeters and weighs just 17 grams. However, despite its small size, it's not lacking in capability as it not only has a 2 megapixel camera that can take HD video and images but also a 2 gigabyte micro SD card and built in LED lights. Sure, that's pretty standard stuff for a drone, but one of this size and cost, that's pretty cool. But considering that it has a fly time of just 5 minutes, the battery life is a little on the low side. Although you'd expect something with 4 propellers to be rather large, the Arius quadcopter stands apart for being the tiniest quadcopter on the market to date. Measuring in at just 3cm by 3cm, it truly is an impressive device due to it having the capability to perform preset tricks at the push of a button, and it can operate at two speeds depending on how quick you'd like it to go. Best of all, it also has a super quick charge time of just 15 minutes via USB charger, making it easy to power up on the fly. However, considering that this gives you just 5 to 7 minutes of action, like the sky, the Arius Copter could benefit from some better battery life. While this device may not seem quite as tiny as some of the other drones on this list, it gains a spot due to it holding the title as being the world's smallest cyclocopter. For reference, a cyclocopter is defined as an aircraft that uses airfoils rotating around a horizontal axis to generate lift and thrust, which essentially allows it to hover in place much like a helicopter does. Now the mini cyclocopter, which was developed by the American University Texas A&M, has a weight of just 29 grams, despite having a rotor with an RPM of 4,000 and its very own autopilot system. And although this cyclocopter is not currently for sale, it certainly is one of the cooler additions to this list. Although most of the drones on this list are small enough to be mistaken for insects, the dragonfly stands apart for being, well, an insect. Now, that's because although the device is still in development, it's essentially an electric backpack that genetically modifies the nervous system of the insects using them so that they can respond to pulses of light. Once these backpacks are set and working, this approach known as optogenetic simulation could then enable dragonflies to carry payloads, conduct surveillance, or even help honeybees become better pollinators. Best of all, due to these dragonfly devices being solar powered, they won't run out of battery in a short period of time. However, when you consider that many attempts to create a similar device before it have failed, it may be a while before this technology becomes viable for the wider market. While the dragonfly may be pretty cool, the tiniest drone in the world puts it to shame. Stick around until the end to find out about this amazing device. If you're looking for a drone that is as impressive as it is futuristic, then look no further than the Drokon Scouter. 
That's because although it comes in at a relatively larger size than the other ones on this list, it stands apart due to it having complete VR capabilities, as via an app you can experience what the drone sees in real time. Interestingly enough, it also has a number of other features such as LED lights so that it can fly at night. It also has flight options such as altitude hold, headless mode, one key backward, one key takeoff, and landing lock and unlock in order to make flying easier, and the ability to do 360 degree flips and rolls. Best of all, at a price of about 60 bucks, you really are getting a lot of bang for your buck. If you're in need of a drone that is on the high end of the market, then look no further than the DJI Mavic Mini. That's because this drone, which has a sleek white design and comes in at dimensions of 16 by 8 by 1 centimeter, truly has all the features you could ever ask for. Most notably, it has an industry-leading fly time of about 30 minutes, a camera with motorized stabilization that can capture 12 megapixel photos and 2.7K video, and due to the strength of its four propellers, it can travel at speeds of up to 47 kilometers per hour. However, if you'd like your own, you better be willing to pay up, as due to it coming in at about 380 bucks, it's far out of the price range of the casual consumer. If you want a drone that is pint-sized yet extremely cost-effective and user-friendly, then the Potensic Nano Quadcopter is for you. That's because although it's pretty basic, it offers three speed modes and has both altitude control and headless mode. And with dimensions of 13.5 by 10 by 8 centimeters, it's only about the width of an iPhone 5. As a result, it comes in at 204 grams and is extremely lightweight, allowing you to take it wherever you go. Best of all, with an above average flight time of 12 minutes and a cost of only about $25 each, these drones really are an excellent choice for drone flyers of all ages. Although many of the drones on this list aren't exactly the most durable devices out there, the RoboBee stands apart due to it being both strong and small. Created by researchers at the Harvard-affiliated Weiss Institute, the RoboBee measures in at about half the size of a paperclip weighs less than one-tenth of a gram and flies using artificial muscles composed of materials that contract when a voltage is applied. However, beyond the fact that it has one-of-a-kind flying style and has the capability of swimming underwater, what makes the RoboBee truly unique is that it's able to act autonomously and can band together with other RoboBees to make decisions as a group, as would a colony of real honeybees. As a result, if the RoboBee can one day be mass produced, it's reasonable to assume that it could be extremely useful in both the pollination of crops or in disaster relief programs. While there are many tiny drones out there, the one that has earned the title of being the smallest of the small is the Mini Picolissimo. Made by Matt Piccoli of the University of Pennsylvania, it's believed to be the world's smallest self-powered controllable flying robot. The smallest of two drones made by Piccoli. It measures in at just 28 millimeters at its widest point, with the top of the device being a propeller and the bottom a 3D printed body both of which spin in different directions. As a result, it comes in at a weight of just 2.5 grams, with it being strong enough to lift weights as heavy as one gram. However, for reference, this is not even enough to lift a US penny. Regardless, the creator hopes that both the Mini Picolissimo and its larger counterpart, the maneuverable Picolissimo, will one day be used to assist in search and rescue operations. That's all we got on small drones. Let us know in the comments which one's your favorite or if we missed one. Thanks for watching Super Freaky Science and don't forget to subscribe.